the given series can be written as in brackets 3 times 1 minus 1 multiplied by in brackets 2 times 1 minus 1 plus in brackets 3 times 2 minus 1 multiplied by in brackets 2 times 2 minus 1 plus in brackets 3 times 3 minus 1 multiplied by in brackets 2 times 3 minus 1 plus and so on. Therefore, the general term or the rth term of the series, let's denote it by ur, is equal to the product of two components. The first component is equal to 3 times r minus 1 and the second component is 2 times r minus 1. Opening this up, ur is equal to 6r square minus 3r minus 2r plus 1 which is equal to 6r square minus 5r plus 1. And therefore, the sum to n terms of the given series, which is equal to summation ur, is equal to summation 6r square minus 5r plus 1, which is equal to 6 times summation r square minus 5 times summation r plus summation 1, where r goes from 1 to n. Putting in the values of summation r square, summation r and summation 1, we get Sn is equal to 6 times n times n plus 1 times 2n plus 1 upon 6 minus 5 times n times n plus 1 upon 2 plus n. Take n upon 2 common, multiplied by in brackets 2 times n plus 1 times 2n plus 1 minus 5 times in brackets n plus 1 plus 2. And this is equal to n upon 2 times in brackets, 2 times in brackets, 2n square plus 3n plus 1 minus 5n minus 5 plus 2. And therefore, sn is equal to n upon 2 multiplied by in brackets, 4n square plus 6n plus 2 minus 5n minus 3, which is equal to n upon 2 times in brackets. 4n square plus n minus 1. And this is the required answer.